In the name of justice, your reign of terror is over, Bufferfish! Why fight me, Tarantula, when you should join me? What? Like me, you'll never be accepted by this world. If that is my fate, then so be it! <laughs> You will never be loved. All this time, he's a monster. I don't care what you are. To me, you're a hero. Mother, father. I finally found my home. <laughs> and that was to rant to lad, the world I call home, quite possibly the finest film ever made. I I've never seen anything like that. So moving, so inspiring. Uh, I wish I could be lovingly embraced by all of humanity. No can do, dude. Low profile, remember? I know, I know, but it's not fair. You got to make your mark in Amphibia. That's because in Amphibia, we weren't in hiding. Ugh, fine. I still can't believe you guys actually liked that movie. It was stuffed with predictable tropes and lazy writing. We have got to cut back on your internet use. All I'm saying is that you'd have to be pretty dense to think any of that would be possible. First of all, the idea that a vigilante would be given free reign. He was just a mild-mannered frog boy who never made a fuss. But he was destined to be something more. Who knows how long he's got left on Earth? But it's time to put his mark on the world and be adored by all! Alright, Earth. Get ready to meet... Frogman! Hey, Sprig, did you see... What are you doing? I'm fulfilling my destiny as Frogman, your neighborhood superhero. You mean neighborhood attention seeker. The only thing I seek is justice. Hop, hop, and away! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>